the painting program in Mexico uh, involves uh, volunteers from Pine to Palm Park who work with Bob and Esther Scott. Bob and Esther uh, coordinate the transportation across and um, there are usually two groups, approximately six in, in a group, and um, we'll go across and, and paint either the new homes that Pine to Palm has built, uh, or we will go in and we'll paint older homes, homes that other groups have built but have not had time to finish painting. And um, huh, most of our paint is, um, a lot of our paint is donated from uh, the Iowa landfill sites through Bob and Esther Scott. And also Pine to Palm uh, Church uh, will give, gives money for paint also. They've um, given enough money so far this year, and it's it's only the middle of February, uh, to paint, oh, they've given about 15 gallons of paint so far. Um, it's a mixed group that go across. Uh, many, many of the group are women and some men. And uh, we can paint two houses in a day. Uh, usually by 2 o'clock we're finished and ready to come back. Carol, you mentioned the, the landfill site. What, where, how do they donate paint? Uh, I'm not positive on how it's done, but if Bob and Esther bring in five-gallon paint, uh, five-gallon pails, the landfill people will hold on to paint and pour it into their pails for them and that way it's free if they have to pay for the if they have to buy the pails it's five dollars a pail and they'll bring down oh possibly 20 to 25 gallons of paint that way are there any special skills needed to do painting the only skill a painter needs is to be able to hold a brush and bend over to dip it in <laughs> A pail of paint. No skills whatsoever. The wood is rough and we only paint the outside. The colors we paint are bright and um, and light trim. It's very easy and it's such a feeling of satisfaction when you're finished and you see this nice bright home for the people in Mexico.